Hello everybody and welcome back. Last episode, we went on a, a little quest to find and speak to uh, the stone speaker. Now, uh, this is continuing on the book quests and we are still on book two. Now, uh, we are able to pick up book three once we're finished with book two here in Oscar Ruth. But uh, what we need to do this episode is uh, pick up a quest that Radagast has for us. Now, I didn't pick it up last episode because I think that it's going to be an, an instance because there's a solo version and a fellowship version. So I'm, I'm really not sure. So we will be clicking on this in just a moment. Um, I would like to ask if you do enjoy my channel to please subscribe and give me a like if you will on any videos that you enjoy. Um, it does help to grow the channel and I appreciate it very much. Without further ado, let's go ahead and see if we can't uh, find out what this quest is all about. Now this is book two, chapter 15. So. Uh, Let's see what I have is. a tale to tell you. The Red Pass. Two young and headstrong youths of the Eglane, Elsa and Ariak, entered Agmar with a small company. They sought to find the power behind the threat to their people. But if the gaunt Lord Ivar has come to Agmar, I fear they face a power they cannot overcome. They need your help. The Red Swamp is divided into two regions. The Southern Marshes, Haragmar, you know those. Elsa and Ariak entered Agamar, the Northern Marshes, uh, through the Red Pass. It's a passage known only to the Eglane and myself. I will accompany you, for the shadow that has come to Agamar is too powerful for you to deal with alone. Oh, wonderful, Radagast. <laughs> I am quite relieved. You have no idea. There's no telling what evil awaits us in the swamp. Return to me when you're prepared to leave. Okay, well, I think we are prepared. So, uh, let's do this. Are you prepared to leave? The Gaunt Lord Ivar spreads corruption through Agamor, the Red Swamp, raising a host of evil to do the bidding of Angmar. We must go west to the Eglane encampment. Elsa and Ariak will be waiting, and I can better attend to the corruption from there. The power which continues to corrupt the swamp's terrible, but we may not have to face it alone. The beasts tell me that there are shades of Emlyn's kind which dwell here and may be convinced to aid the Eglane. I do not know why they do not remain with their own kind, but they at least have not brought harm to the Eglane. Now, we must hurry. The very trees scream in pain. I must see what I can do to help them as quickly as possible. Follow me, though I cannot promise aid, for I fear I will need all of my strength to face Ivar the Bloodhound. Okay. Let us head for the camp. All right. This is quite creepy. Oh, the tree. Great, this is a 32. We're holding our own so far. It's not doing a lot of damage that I usually do, I fear. Okay. 
Boy, that tree was tough, though. I'm going to stay back just a little bit because he will notify me if we're being attacked, and I'd rather get him from far away like there. There, it's better for both of us. Wonder who are you? Who are you going after? The prowler? Or the tree? I don't know. Well, let me fire on this. Okay. Thank you, Radagast. Root. Okay. Oh, no. Yep, and here it comes. He's coming after me. Oh, no. Okay, where's this prowler at? Or are these guys? Okay. Okay, we're good. Sealed by an evil power? Oh, good. I think this little fox is our friend. <laughs> Radagast is healing me, so at least there's that. He's talking to the little rabbit. Oh.
have a fox and a rabbit. And there's a squirrel there. He's probably going to go talk to that squirrel also. Okay. Oh, that tree, though. Maybe not. little hands. Those are so creepy. Luckily, it looks like when he's hitting me, he's not really hurting me that much. Danison. Well met, sir. Where have the Eglane gone? I can speak not of such matters. Nevin bids it. Speak to this shit again. Perhaps there's more he can tell us. Okay. Nevin orders me to hold my post, and I must obey. He is our commander. I am under his charge, as are my men. Honor binds us, even greater than the curse of Irwain Benadar. I will not forsake my commander, though he is so very changed. I cannot disobey his orders while he remains. If thou wish us to fight, thou must entreat with Nevin. He's, he's, his seat is to the north. Okay. I have to defeat him. Um, is this is where I'm supposed to go? Uh, Radagast. He left me. Do I need to go this way? I don't know. Let's see if we can go in here. Nope, I can't go in there. Okay. Um. Yep, he's gonna attack me. Oh, there. Okay. Um, can I get around there? No. Maybe. Yep, I thought so.
Here we go. Nevin, the White Lord. Oh boy, where's Radagast? I thought he was going to help me with this. Oh dear. Okay, um, I don't have any other buffs I can put on myself. Other than this one, which helps me run. <laughs> maybe, maybe if I can run away fast. No. Uh, all right. Let's see. Oh. I can't attack him. <gasps> Your presence is unwelcome. But amusing. What did you hope to accomplish? It will not matter. Soon I shall claim your bones for Ivar. Uh-oh. Okay, now we got it. Oh no, there's more coming. Oh, I got Nevin! Unless this is a vile trick. I think I got him. Speak to Dennison. Okay. Holy moly. Okay. Dannison, I defeated Nevin. <sighs> a white, a fell creature of Angmar. How could I not have seen this? So long I have lingered in the swamp, cursed by Arwain Benadar to bring the salvation or the destruction of the Red Maid. She who dwells within Garth Ogwen a power now under the influence of the Gauntman. I was blind to what Nevin had become. Now I shall make amends. Now we shall make our battle and strive to fulfill our curse. So I need to follow the shade deeper into Agmar. Hey, let's do this. Sticking with him unless he disappears on me. Storm the gates. Radagast. Oh! I spoke too soon. Oh, there he is! Oh, you don't know how happy I am to see you, Radagast. me going here and I will protect us as best I can. Oh! 
we found them. Fantastic. At least they're still alive. Oh, man. Bellany, all of you, I sense our journey is nearly at an end. Rest now and speak to Elsa. Her insight may prove helpful in the fight ahead. Okay. We were beaten. There's no way to hide this. This Ivar commands the water, the whites, and the forest itself. He cannot be beaten by my meager force, and I fear there's something far more terrible within the ruins to the north. I know there's little time before great evil spills forth from, from Garth Agawin. Our only hope is Radagast. Only he will be able to stop this Ivar. Please go north to the gate of Garth Agawin and stop Gaunt Lord Ivar. Okay, I think we will do our best on that. Don't you worry. Hurry now. The Gaunt Lord Ivar is not far from here, near the gates of Garth Agwin to the north. He may not reveal himself immediately, so we may need to draw him forth. The way ahead will be difficult, but do not give up hope. We shall triumph this day if we do not lose heart. Okay. Um. Yes, Ivar. <gasps> oh, boy. Oh. Oh my goodness. He's gonna get away. Oh, that son of a gun. There he goes. She shall be free from your clutches soon enough. That creature commands great power, but against a heart full of hope and trust in one's allies, such power means nothing. Thank you for your help here, my friend. We have done well this day. 
Ivar's spreading corruption has stayed, at least for the moment. I must return now to the Eglane encampment and help end this evil forever. There's more that you ought to do here, if you're willing, but we will not speak of such matters now. Shall we return? Uh, yes, please. I think I've had enough of this place. I came too late to breathe and too early to Weathertop, where beyond my aid, the Witch King and his minions attacked Frodo, wounding him with a Morgul blade. Thankfully, Aragorn was there to save him. All right, so... Let's go up there and talk to Elsa. There's Ariak. Hello, Elsa. What do you need? Thank you again for your aid, Bellany. You should speak now with Radagast the Brown. He's waiting for you within the tower here in the camp. Okay. Thank you. Oh, hello, Ariak. He's got some quests. What is this world coming to? You come from Friedrich? Then you are welcome here. There are many threats here against which you will be able to test your strength. Okay. Oh my god! 27! <laughs> Sweet. Okay, so... We need to talk to Radagast. I believe he's in here. Well, Radagast, that was very uh, interesting and a little bit spooky. I shall remain here and help the Glane fight against Ivar. I cannot allow innocent creatures to be used for such evil purposes. I understand. 36 agility, that's what I'm taking. I must bid you farewell for now. The Glane and our Arthdane allies were able to stop Ivar's forces, at least for the time being. I'm needed elsewhere and must bid you farewell for now. Elsa wishes to speak with you. Okay. He has another quest for me, though. Oh, my goodness. All right. I think um, we are going to not pick those up just yet. Or maybe I should in case he's gone next time I log in. Let's see what this I is. I fear now. there is little to be done. Okay, we have to defeat Gloomleaf. Now that's a level 30. Okay. Grimbark's reclamation. Will you help me? Collect Grimbark's seeds. Okay. Merciful release. So, Defeat it has Burns come to Bob. this. Wow, this seems like uh, this interesting something I could probably there do. There is great evil here. Corrupted stumps. Okay. Well, we'll see what we can do with those. Not this episode. <laughs> Thank you for joining me today, everybody. Please give me a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And hope to see you next time. Take care, all. Bye-bye now.